Hello everyone, welcome to So Think Quicker for Silver Light tutorial. Here, I will show you how to create motion twin. After launching So Think Quicker for Silver Light, it pops up a dialog. Input a name for your work and choose a folder to save. In the Properties panel, input the value for dragged slider to set dimension and choose blank as a background color for your movie. Right-click anywhere in the Library panel and choose Import to make the prepared image list on the Library panel. Double-click the images to rename them in pop-up window. In the Timeline, Double-click the layers to rename them in pop-up window. Choose a layer and drag image from library panel to the canvas. The first frame turns into keyframe. Adjust its position on the canvas. Add a new layer and drag logo image to settle here. Create a text layer and input the text in the box. You can edit the text properties in the bottom panel. Put the image and the logo and make it become reflection. Drag the two images to the right part. The top image is blue stripe and the bottom is its reflection. Here is the area for motion twin. Create a new layer and click the frame 15 to insert a blank keyframe. Place the colorful stripe outside of the canvas. This frame turns into keyframe and then press F6 on the keyboard to add a keyframe in frame 25. Move the image to the canvas to cover the blue stripe. Redo the previous operations to settle the reflection of colorful stripe. Right click any frame between two frames. Choose the create motion twin. Add two layers. Insert blank keyframe in frame 26 and drag the yellow stripe and its reflection to frame. Do you want to create a gradient effect doing the motion twin? You can set transparent on pictures. Press F6 to add a keyframe in frame 35. Move images to new planes and then Create motion twin between the two frames. Add a frame to make logo area to show for all the time. The timeline will display like this. Click button preview to view the movie. If the movie is OK, click button export to publish the movie. Now the save folder opens, you can view movie in the browser.
Thanks for watching.